Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how you can show user's current location on MK Map View. Uh, I'll be doing some tutorial series of MK Map View. Uh, so this is the first time. Uh, let's start the project. I'm going to create a new project. It's a single view application. Uh, I'll name this as my map view project and I'll save it on my desktop then i change the deployment target as 7.1 and uncheck the landscape left and right I just I just don't need those okay first thing you need to do is go to the main storyboard and map mm, add a map view map view here it is Alright, I'm gonna add some constraints. Then set the delegate on the storyboard. I'm gonna create an outlet from the map view to my implementation file just to be easy. I name it my map view. Okay. Okay, you see the error pops up. That's because I haven't imported the MapKit framework. To do that, you wanna go to Build Faces, under Link Binary with Libraries, add the framework MapKit. Then go to your view controller H or dot M whatever you file. Then import that framework map it map it dot h uh, if you build the project now you'll see the error message goes away i'm gonna add the map kit uh map view delegate protocol let's call mk map view delegate um i'll say my map view shows user location yes my map view shows buildings yes now you think it should show the user current location right okay actually it's not showing i'll run this project on my device just let me open the reflector application I'm going to run this project now. Uh, it's taking time. Uh, the map is not showing my current location. Actually, it should be right here. Right here. No, it's not showing. And what's, what's going on? Actually, it's a little bit different from iOS 6 to iOS 7, 8, 9. Uh, there's an uh, info playlist file. You need to add a row here. It's called NS location when in use usage description. And it contains a string. The string uh, you you have seen uh, you have seen apps uh, required current location uh, when you open the application it asks you permission and then it can send some message that message goes here so I'm gonna enter please give me your permission to get your location 
even though I added the row here, row to that uh, info field is fire. Actually, I need a location manager to get the current location. So I'm gonna create here a location manager, location manager. Then I'm, then I'm gonna initiate that variable location manager CL location manager new if that location manager responds to the selector which is request the use authorization then I'm gonna say location manager request when in use authorization uh, map view contains some map view delegate protocol methods uh, if you wanna now actually it's showing the current location let's uh, run this project now Okay, I think I think I lost my connection on Reflect application. Uh, just give me a second. Okay, here it comes. Run the project. Now it's asking my permission. See, this is the message I I typed there. Please give me a permission to get your location. Okay, I'm gonna say hello. Then you see uh, my current location has been detected here it's right here but you think uh, what if you want to zoom into your current location as it actually uh, doesn't zoom into your current location now to do that you need to implement a map view delegate method that's called map view did update user location uh, then you have to create a map MK map camera then set it to your map key, map view I'm gonna do that now uh, map view set camera okay, I'm gonna create a map camera camera MK map camera here goes the coordination user location coordinate uh, here goes the latitude and longitude. Then CL location coordinates to DMAC. Yeah. Then user location coordinate latitude. Here goes the longitude. Uh, I altitude is in feet. I'm go. I'm gonna put ten thousand here then set the camera okay if you wanna zoom into your current location actually this is the way but this method doesn't get called uh, if you wanna if you wanna call this method you need to actually set the location manager to update start update location to do that location manager start updating locations this is the way now I think I'm done uh, actually let's uh, let's run this project now I think I lost my connection again All right. 
please give me a second again please you shit project now you see it's zooming into my current location here I am okay I think I made my tutorial here uh, I said I'll be doing a series of tutorials of this MK map view uh, like how you can add multiple annotations and how to customize customize them with your customized images and uh, customized colors uh, I'll be doing those videos future so if you like this video please hit thumbs up uh, for more videos subscribe to this channel okay guys I'll see you next time bye